Mr. Fishy. Hey, Mr. Fishy. Hello again, my little ones. How we doing out there? Thank you guys all for tuning in to another episode of Mr. Fishy and Friends, the place where we all learn cool things. <laughs> in today's reading, we shall be reading Pete the Cat, I Love My White Shoes. Huh. Hope we all familiar with Mr. Pete and his wonderful imagination. I'm excited to read this one. I hope you guys are too. Now, before we start this reading, what do we need first? Yes, our special reading glasses. Whew. Much better. Let's dive in, shall we? Pete the Cat, I Love My White Shoes. Story by Eric Litwin, illustrated by James Dean. Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. Pete loved his white shoes so much, he sang this song. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. Oh no! Pete stepped into a large pile of strawberries. What color did they turn his shoes? Red. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along singing his song. Everything is cool. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. Oh no! Pete stepped in a large pile of blueberries. What color did he turn his shoes? Blue. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Awesome. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Oh no. Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. What color did he turn his shoes? Brown. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Groovy. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. Oh no! Pete stepped in a bucket of water. And all the brown, and all the blue, and all the red were washed away. What color were his shoes again? White. But now they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness no. He kept walking along and singing his song. Rock and roll. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. The moral of Pete's story is, no matter what you step in, keep walking along and singing your song. Because it's all good. As always, Pete has a great imagination. Time for our regular glasses now. Ah, much better. <laughs> did you guys all enjoy the story? I know I did. I love Pete and his imagination and his upbeat, positive spirit. It seems like there's nothing to get this cat down. <laughs> I mean, he stepped in a giant pile of strawberries that turned his shoe red. Did he complain? Nope, just kept singing his tune. And even when they got stuck in dirty mud, did he get all mad and angry? Nope, he just kept on singing his tune. And I like that about Pete. Seems like he always keeps an upbeat, positive mentality, which we all should. Always be positive, no matter what. Okay, little ones, that's all the time we have today. As always, if you guys like what you see, make sure to like, subscribe, and tell a friend. I'm sure they'll be happy you did. And before we go, let's all try fishing in the waters of knowledge. You'll never know what you'll catch. Take it easy, little ones. I'll see you in the next one.